Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Valentina, in case you don't know me. And in today's video, I'm going to give you a few tips or a few shirt hacks that will help you use your shirts in different ways. For these tips, you can even use your partner's shirt. And it's going to be about how to style your shirt, how to tuck in your shirts, and all of these things. So if you're interested, then just keep on watching. The first tip is key. It might be too obvious for a lot of you guys, but it might not be as obvious for a lot of you. If you're wearing a white shirt and you don't want to show anything that's underneath, then use a nude bra. Do not go for a white bra underneath a white t-shirt because that's always going to show up. So unless you want to go for a bralette and be very intentional with it, then just stick to a nude bra and that's going to be invisible. Okay, so this second hack is more of a styling hack. I know it's not going to be for everyone, but I do love it and it looks especially good in those shirts that have a different color in the cuffs, but you can also do it in a white shirt as well. Always, always roll up your sleeves. That's going to give it a more relaxed look, and especially if you're wearing your partner's shirt or is it like an oversized shirt, you want to make it look that it's fitting properly even though it's intentional instead of just looking big. So I wanted to show you a different way of rolling up your sleeves. You want to put your cuff all the way up your sleeve, so it's, don't start rolling, but just just keep the cuff to where you want the sleeve and then you can start rolling that bottom part. I know it's a little bit easier to see it than to explain it, but then you're going to leave the cuff exposed and it's going to look more stylish. And again, I know it's going to be way easier for you to see it on the screen than to hear me out. One thing that I really like to do with my shirts is to fold up the color to make it look a little bit more elegant, to make it look more chic and more relaxed, mm, kind of like a Carolina Herrera type of look. You want to unbutton a few of the buttons on the top and I always like to get the shoulder line and pull it up a little bit, that way I'm not going to show a lot of cleavage, that's not my style, but if you don't mind then that's okay. Or if you're using a roulette, then that's okay because you want to show it. So in that case, you don't need to do that, but I will do it this time. And of course, rolling up your sleeves, and that's going to give you a more effortless look. And if you put your hair in a bun and you add a little bit of accessories, it's going to look so, so nice. This is one of my favorite ways to use it. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up if you're enjoying this video. Okay, so the last two shirt hacks are going to be on how to tuck in your shirt. The first one is very easy, it's very straightforward, and it's the hack to fold your shirt underneath before tucking it in. That's going to prevent any bunching that you can get from the shirt, so just fold it underneath, and for the back, if the tail is too long, that's probably going to happen if you're wearing an oversized shirt, you wanna make sure that you're tucking it all the way through and that way if you're using high-waisted jeans which is my recommendation you're going to accentuate your waist and it's going to make it look thinner and nicer and last but not least is the crossover top for this one you want to unbutton all of your shirt and i'm going to change my bra just for this video purpose and be comfortable filming this you want to start tucking in your pants, but you're going to do it over your waist. But you're going to do it all the way around, and that way you're going to get a crossover effect. Again, this is way easier to see than understand with my words. I don't know how to explain it, but I think you can see what I mean. You might have to spend a few minutes straightening out, make sure that you tuck in all the way through, all around your body, and that way you're going to get a more elegant effect with the same oversized shirt and it's just a different way to wear your shirt and very fun. That is all, I hope you enjoyed this video and that you apply some of these tips that I show you today 
in your daily life, let me know in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I'll see you in the next video. Tchau,